animation of the hypothesis that the cervix transforms into the lower uterine segment through the TY, VU, and inverted U pattern due to direct and indirect uterine cervical interaction and its subsequent reversal. Dr. Ali Hagasi, Department of Obstetrics and Gynecology, Portion Kula University Hospital, Bolinaslo, Ireland. Blossom Medical Company, Houston, USA. The mechanisms responsible for the maintenance of pregnancy and the initiation of parturition have not been fully explained in any species. Failure to properly understand the uterine function during pregnancy is a major shortcoming of modern healthcare, and this lack of understanding has many possible causes. Importantly, there may be a flaw in the current concept of human parturition that acts as a barrier to obtaining a better understanding of parturition. The isthmus of the cervix, its anatomical and functional existence, rationale, and consequences should be reconsidered. There has been no convincing evidence to support its existence since Ashoff first proposed it in 1905. To answer 200 years old question, what is the origin of the lower uterine segment, LUS? This study investigates the current evidence based that may support Roterer and Mauriso's hypothesis, the 1800s, that the LUS is derived from the cervix. A 40-second 3D animation supporting the hypothesis was developed in conjunction with Houston-based Blossom Medical Communications. During the first and the second trimester, the cervix is a T-pattern. In the third trimester, uterine contractions transform the cervix to a Y-pattern, then a V-pattern, and finally, at full term, a U-pattern with concomitant development of the lower uterine segment cranially. During the progress of labor, the U-shape inverts upward with a complete transformation of the cervix into the lower uterine segment and its disappearance. The cervix regains its shape instantly after delivery due to reversal of these changes. The outcome of the hypothesis. The progressive loss of the cervical strength during pregnancy through a TYVU pattern is secondary to its transformation into the lower uterine segment. It is also due to direct and indirect uterine cervical interaction. The cervix keeps its strength to the last fibers and U pattern initiates labor. The duration of TYVU pattern dictates the duration of pregnancy. Direct and indirect uterine cervical interaction dictates the duration of TYVU pattern through the interactive relationship between the uterine force, the cervical strength, cephalon pelvic proportion. Unanswered questions. Cervical integrity is essential for a successful pregnancy. So what is the primary function of the cervix during pregnancy? Loss of cervical strength initiates labor. So what is the mechanism that initiates labor when the cervix loses resistance? 